Good day, I'm Brian Mustard. This is vlog number three. I'm just heading out here, but uh, I just wanted to get this one out, so and I'll keep this one short. Um, today I'm talking about uh, personal identity and personality type. Uh, in the first two vlogs, I talked about potential and abilities and strength and opportunities. This is somewhat similar. Um, this is very much in the line of... Uh, of uh, an identity foundation. Um, knowing your personality type, your value system is a very uh, key component that ties with your strengths and abilities. Is that once you know this, you can, um, when you're forming your goals or doing any sort of vision work and what you want to uh, want for yourself and for your life or where you see yourself, um, knowing this can help you better identify uh, where you want to be and and you, you might be able to recognize uh, if your goals are in alignment with your um, personality type or your value system so uh, I'll maybe leave a link here to a few useful tools that I've found uh, one is uh, Myers-Briggs test Hexaco test, and I think there's a few uh, values and strengths te uh, strength tests. But I found them useful. Um, it's debatable on the absolute accuracy of these tests. Uh, I think a lot of it is subjective. But one of the things I found is, even though that uh, they may not be 100% accurate, by doing a few of them, you'll really get a really good sense of... Um, of uh, who you are as a person, where your personality type is. Now I'm an ENTP uh, on the Myers-Briggs, which means I'm extroverted. I make decisions on based on intuition. I'm a perceiver, so I like to see um, strategies. I like problem solving. Um, so I try to place myself in situations where uh, I can be a, a benefit. Um, so yeah, so anyways, let me know um, if you've ever done any of these tests, how you found them, and how, you know, does it affect you on how you uh, identify and pick your goals? And is it something that um, by knowing this and, and by doing it, you think might, might bring value to uh, goal setting? Anyways, uh, Thanks for thanks for this and uh, leave any comments below and thank you for my uh, the comments on the previous ones and uh, yeah stay tuned to the next ones uh, I'm going to be talking about a um, little bit more on uh, not just foundational thought stuff but I'll be really getting into nitty gritty and throwing a lot of content your way so stay tuned and uh, see you on the other side bye for now.